Hey, Roster Watch Nation. Trippelli Never Trash Man back with another rookie spotlight. Today, I'm going to be talking about Cornelius Johnson, wide receiver out of Michigan. Um, overall, prototypical X receiver type build, six foot three, 208 pounds. Um, he does have small hands, so he's only got nine inch hands, which I guess for a smaller receiver, doesn't seem that small, although it still seems kind of on the small side. Um, but for a yeah, receiver over six foot, um, back six foot three, um, that does seem pretty small. And if you look at his tape, you can kind of tell he has trouble um, bringing in balls with his hands. Um, oftentimes, he has a lot of body catches, a lot of double catches. Um, some concentration drops, but you know, that might be another issue entirely, but yes, he does have small hands. I'm pretty fast though. Um, expecting him to run a high four, four, or low four, five, um, in the 40, um, he's fast for his size. Um, doesn't have great long speed, but he's quick off the line. He's quick in space and he's been a deep threat at Michigan. You know, speaking of Michigan, um, they were a run-heavy team. I mean, everyone knows that. Um, they're a run-heavy team that won the national championship um, this past season. And for that reason, Johnson just was not utilized that often in the offense. You know, um, he had – his arguably his best season was in 2022 – he tallied 462 yards and six touchdowns on 29 catches. Um, he had more yardage, 620 yards in 2021, but he only scored three times this season. This last year, his fifth year, he's a fifth-year senior, he had 42 catches for 567 yards and only one touchdown. You know, so the biggest knock against Johnson that you're probably going to hear about, that you're probably going to see, is his uneven production. And I think that was at least in part due to just the run heavy scheme of that Michigan offense. Johnson, as a pass catcher, displays mostly positive characteristics. He's, like I said, he's tall, he's he's wide, he's got lots of range. He's one of those, uh, he's a quarterback's best friend, really, kind of guy you can throw the ball up to, and he's probably going to come down with it good in contested catches. Um, he plays with a lot of vigor. Plays with a lot of power, even though he is a lankier, kind of skinnier receiver. He's a really good blocker, really willing blocker, very effective in that role. And I think that can take him far as to getting, you know, playing time at the next level. Sometimes his high motor gets the best of him, though. It's, it's hard for him to, like, um, be patient enough to settle down in zones, get open there. Um, he is able to gain separation and and, and the press zone man coverage, though. Um, as I said, he is quick off the line, and he's a powerful receiver who's willing to fight uh, to get open. He's also not afraid to go into traffic to make the catch or sacrifice his body. Um, and he can make defenders miss after the catch. You know, he's agile enough for a rec receiver of his side, but he doesn't quite have that hip wiggle. Um to really be evasive before the catch or, and he doesn't have the long speed, the uh, kind of elite long speed you would need um, to keep people from catching up, up, up with you from behind. So that often happens from though. He's, you know, not terribly easy to bring down um, when you get your hands on him. As far as his fantasy outlook goes, Johnson will be old for a rookie. He'll be 24 in November. Like I said, I don't think that'll be the biggest knock against him. I think the biggest knock against him will be just the questionable production in college. As he truly never had a breakout season, you know, I blame it in part on the scheme, like I said. But, you know, maybe he's never quite had the opportunity to be um, like the alpha receiver. He did lead the team in receiving in 2022, though. It's in touchdowns. Um, 
that all being said, I see Johnson as a late round pick who can develop into an every down player on the right team. Um, the player I compared him to was Cedric Tillman, who plays for the Browns now. Another lanky, um, taller receiver with decent speed, knows how to get open, plays with uh, plays with some pop. So there you have it, Cornelius Johnson. We'll get more eyes on him um, in the upcoming week weeks, and we'll get back to you on him. So there you have it, another rookie spotlight, Cornelius Johnson out of Michigan. If you like what you're hearing, if you liked your heard, leave us a comment, give us a follow. Join us at Roster Watch Nation. Until next time, be ready.